Hello everyone. My name is Munun, and I am a technical consultant here at Glidefast. Today, I will take you through a quick and efficient integration between ServiceNow and Slack. It might be a challenge to have all the workforce to migrate to a new platform when it comes to submitting IT issues. Organizations which use Slack as their primary source of internal communication have an option to use the ServiceNow app for Slack that allows you to create and manage ServiceNow incidents right from your Slack workspace. To begin with, navigate to the Slack app directory and search for ServiceNow for Slack. Click on the Add to Slack button. Verify the permissions the app requests to access your Slack workspace and click Allow. Once installed, you should see the app under the Apps section on your Slack instance. The app homepage shows the steps to follow to complete the integration. Take a note of the redirect URL and the logo URL from step number one. We will need these during our next step. On your ServiceNow instance, navigate to System OAuth Application Registry. Click on the New button on the top right hand side of the header bar. Select, create an OAuth API endpoint for external clients. Let's name our app, Slack for ServiceNow. Notice, the client ID is auto-populated. Paste the redirect URL and the logo URL that we copied from Slack during the earlier steps. Looks good. Let's right click on the header bar and hit save. Once the form reloads, copy the client ID and the client secret. We will use these values during our next steps. Back on Slack. Return to the service now for Slack app. Click on the Connect ServiceNow to Slack button under the Connect Your ServiceNow Instance to Slack section. Enter your ServiceNow Instance URL in the first box. Enter the client ID and the client secret that you copied from the earlier steps in the respective boxes and hit Submit. The registration is successful. Let's finish the connection. Click on the Connect Your Account button which should then navigate you to a ServiceNow page, asking you to allow Slack to connect to your instance. Let's click on Allow. And we are done. Your ServiceNow instance is now connected to your Slack workspace. Let's go back to Slack and try to create an incident. On our demo channel, I will do slash create and select the Create an Incident shortcut. Let's enter a short description and a description. We would also select the impact and urgency for this incident. Notice, the caller is auto-populated to the current logged-in user on Slack. However, you could submit an incident on behalf of another user by searching for them in the Select Caller field. Everything looks good, we would now hit Create. In a few seconds, the app should tell us that we now have an incident created for us. Notice, we have additional functions at the bottom here which allows us to add or view comments on the incident, as well as update the state. Clicking the incident number should take us directly to the respective record on ServiceNow. That was all for today's tutorial on how to integrate ServiceNow with Slack. Thank <laughs> you.